A close-up look at the devastation of the Corral fire. They saw it coming, but they didn't they weren't aware of how fast it was moving. Travis Curtis says his elderly parents grabbed their two dogs and turtle when the sheriff knocked on their door with evacuation orders Saturday evening. As they were pulling out, they could see that the, the barn was going up. The fire burned through this field behind the Curtis's property and then made contact here. This is where the barn used to be. The flames caught the barn on fire and then just spread through the rest of the property. And the wind just pushed it, all the embers over and that just carried through the house. When the wind comes along, it can kick up embers and blow them over the containment line, which you never want. Um, but that's why that's why we're still here. Cal Fire has pulled back some resources, but crews are still working to catch the hot spots, especially before the 100 degree temperature days arrive this week. The biggest concern is that we're going to have a heat wave and that uh, a lot of fires are human caused throughout California. So we just want people to make good decisions. Cal Fire is concerned another fire could start and warns people to be careful, not careless. That means that we have the power to control how this wildfire year will go and this summer will go. The cause of the Corral fire has yet to be discovered and now the Curtises have to figure out how to move on at this stage in their lives. Nobody wants to see their parents in this kind of a situation. You know, nobody wants to see their parents technically homeless right now. That, 75 and 84 years old, you know, it, it's, um, it's heartbreaking. In San Joaquin County, Michelle Bandur, KCRA 3 News.